they finally realize what they lost they want to make a comeback but it's too late they want to come back in your life after they had taken you for granted for so long after they had ignored you after they walked away from you after they treated you with so much disdain contempt after they had no regard for you you who had been by their side you who had been there for them They walked away, took you for granted, disrespected you. You were trying to reach out to them. They were nowhere to be found. Or so it seemed. Because they were right there. They were right there on social media. They were right there close to their phone. You tried to reach out to them, but they ignored you. You tried to keep the friendship going, but they were too busy. They were there making their money things were working out for them or so it seemed they were feeling good they were happy so who were you they wanted to show you who's the boss around here they did not realize that winning is what you do as the breeze is blowing and I'm hearing nature sending you all of this positive energy they did not realize that you're just a winner end of story now that they are realizing your greatness the fact that you are winner now that you're winning now that you're doing well they want to come back in your life they want to be there they want to share in your glory they did not want to be part of your story all the obstacles you faced all the failures no but now they want to be part of your glory they want everybody to say oh wow you her friend? You his friend? Oh wow. Wow. That's amazing. You must be great too. They want to be part of it. So you will be getting the DM. Or you've gotten the DM. Or you get that DM, that message. They're in your inbox on social media. They're trying to get back in your life. Perhaps things did not work out for them the way they thought it would. So they're trying to get back in your life. They're sending you this message. How are you doing? And often they're blaming it on you. They're blaming it on you. They're pretending that you're the one who has ignored them. You're the one who forgot about them. They're making some joke. They're trying to get back in your life. But did I say it's too late? They're trying to get back in your life. They want to be part of your light. They realize everybody's talking about you. Everybody seems to be more informed about you than them. They who were there before, everyone seems to be more informed. They feel that it is 
they who should be telling others about you and your achievements you and your greatness but they have nothing to say because they alienated alienated themselves from you so they're trying to make a comeback in your life they try to come back in your life they're trying to be there once again they're messaging you and they're saying things like they lost your number they're lying they did not lose your number there are so many ways to contact you you contacted them they never responded they had better wear the cap if it fits them don't hate on the message on the messenger make a change hmm how about that as this ant has decided to come on me it's all right we're in nature the birds are singing ha huh? i hear a very loud bird did it hear me say that the bird is right there as confirmation that you're on the right track you're watching a video like this you're on the right track congratulations smash the like button as they say click the like button for the youtube algorithm you're watching a video like this super congratulations i can hear the birds and i'm all about sending you good vibes it's all about good news in a world of constantly negative news cnn and it's likes how about that it trying to get back in your life You've been thinking about this for days, for weeks, for months. How come this person left? You've been trying to figure it out. You've been even blaming yourself sometimes. Is it something you did? You're asking questions. And very often it's nothing you did. Very often people will walk away, as soon as they make some money, they walk away, they think, oh, now I'm rich, now I'm a billionaire, when they're not. Very often you're doing better than them. They are not a match for money. They start to act in a funny way. They get a little achievement, they start to act in a funny way. They forget that you were the one helping them all along. They forget all the good you've done for them. They pretend that you never help them. A lack of gratitude cuts the wires that connect you to the source of abundance, to the source of success, to the source of everything good, to the source of money, to the source of wealth, to the source of you name it. A lack of gratitude and they have no gratitude. Ungrateful. They have forgotten. How quickly they have forgotten. Then one day, they remember, they hear about you, they remember, and they're trying to creep back in, thinking that things will still be the same, but things are no longer the same as the ants are here, <laughs> they are there, the ants are coming, hey, the ants are coming, the ants are coming. In nature they're climbing that is what they do <laughs> they don't bite apparently they don't bite these hands don't bite so we're fine feel the good vibes nature it's important to get into nature to be at one with nature to clear your mind to clear your vibration to throw to throw out all of this garbage and negative energy to clean up to clean up it's not about throwing away the negative energy but more about bringing in the positive energy how about that that is a better way to put it tapping into the positive energy tapping into the source of all blessings the source from which all blessings flow to be at one with the most high to be at one with infinite intelligence to be at one with the universe how about that they're seeing your great work they're seeing your greatness and now they want to come back too late is their cry too late shall be their cry too late is their cry and i'm sure you saw it coming as the advancing person that you are i'm sure that you saw it coming i i am sure that you knew that 
that day would come when they would want to be part of your story or part of your life once again that they want to that they would have wanted to work together with you once again hmm but things are different now things are different now they are not indispensable when they left they created a vacancy and somebody else has filled that vacancy some new energy something else has filled that vacancy you're looking at things differently now whatever they are, they were offering you you're getting it from somewhere else and it's even better now you would not go back to that you're better off yes sometimes you'd figure like you still love this person whether it be a romantic relationship or a friendship you still like or love this person you still want the best for them but how can you let them be around you again when they have shown their true colors it's so hard they have shown their true colors they were not for you they are not for you they are hypocrites they are a hypocrite he or she is a hypocrite so as much as you would want to let them back in your life as much as you would want to hold their hand you just cannot because you are not a hypocrite because you like genuine people around you you know that they are not for you a lot of people appear when you start to win some will disappear mind you because they are jealous their heart is full of envy they are in a secret competition with you but then some others will appear they will appear because they want to share in your glory they want everybody to say that hey congrats you're working with her you're working with him wow you're amazing you're great because of their association with you so they're knocking on your door once again because of that pretending that something went wrong they lost their phone like I said they lost your number something was wrong oh they're lying they should know that you're smart enough to see through their lies through their lies how dare them insult your intelligence I'm sure they know better than that I'm sure they know that they cannot fool you so easily so why are they trying desperation they desperately want to be back in your life let me tell you just keep your head up high just keep advancing just keep pressing on the upward way you will be getting new heights every day things will work out for you when they walk away from you when they create that space something else something better comes I have found along my journey that something better always comes things don't work out for you so that things can work out for you things don't work out for you on a micro level but on a, on a macro level from broader perspective things are always working out for you do you know this to be true if you know this to be true I think you know if you have been watching this channel it is true what does this mean thoughts become things your thoughts create your reality when you know that something is true you become a vibrational match for that thing you will have it faith knowing it will cause you to it will cause you to take inspired action and you will manifest whatever you want people will come into your life I just heard my tummy boil 
I've been doing a bit of intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting is good. It really helps. Because I love my food, but with some intermittent fasting, after lunch, I can eat a little more. <laughs> than if I did not fast in the morning. Have you ever tried that? Let me know in the comments. So back on topic, they want to be in your life. They realize how well you're doing. They want to be in your life once again, but it's too late. You can no longer walk with them. You can no longer be around them after they have shown their true colors. It doesn't mean that you want bad for them. No. It doesn't mean that you wish them anything negative. No. You wish them well. What you want for yourself, you want for them too. You wish that they are successful too. You wish that they are doing well too. You're in no competition. You are not in a competition with them. They thought the two of you were in a competition, but you never accepted that invitation to participate in the competition you wish them well you hope that they do well they can do well over there and you will do well over here wanting the best for someone doesn't mean that you hold hands it doesn't mean that you work together They have already proven that they are not a true friend. They have already shown you that they are not there for you. You are not a match for each other. Let them be. Like Bishop TDJ said, when people can walk away from you, let them walk. Have the gift of goodbye. Let people go. Let people walk away. They want to walk away, let them walk away. You're not about to beg anybody to stay with you. You're not about to beg anybody to be around you. You let them go. You let them be. Knowing that it is a good thing. It is a good thing. Sometimes when people walk away, you will feel a degree of sadness because they walked away. It is just that you're so attached or so hooked or your energy is so intertwined with theirs that when they walk away you miss them. You miss them. In a romantic relationship very often you can tell the, uh, you and the person apart in terms of energy. The two energies are so intertwined. When they walk away you feel like your entire world has crumbled. Yo, you get a broken heart, you feel terrible, but let it be, it is for a reason. The universe, the most high often removes people from our lives because they were not meant to be in our lives for any longer. Some people are just there for a season and some people are there to teach us a lesson. The season is over. Or you have already learned the lesson that was supposed to be learned. You let them go. And if they walk away from you, you try to reach out to them, they were nowhere to be found. That is all right. I have already moved on, my brother. I have already moved on, my sister. You have already moved on. You are living a different life, so to speak. They don't even know you anymore. They think you're still the same person. You're not. You've already moved on. You have become more. You're winning like never before. And you are gonna win and win and win because winning is what you do. I'm here in nature as the breeze is blowing. I welcome this breeze. And I'm sending you some of it <laughs> through the screen. But not through the screen actually, on a vibrational level. Because we are connected, vibrationally. I'm in the same universe that you're in. And I bet you we're on the same planet, aren't we? Unless if you're some alien. Which you're not. Huh? 
awesome robot, are you? No, no you're not. Sending you loads of positive energy. Click the like button if you haven't done so. I want to hear what you have to say. What is your story? Share it in the comments. Share the video. Let's build this advancing community. I'm so thankful for you. Within the last few months, this channel is blowing up like never before. For an entire year I was building this channel, things were slow and then things just start to pick up and things are going crazy. The top video on this channel has over 205,000 views as I speak. So I thank you, without you, there would be no advancing channel. Perhaps there would be a channel, but who would be watching and what would be the point? It's like a tree falling in the forest and there's no one to hear it. It doesn't make a sound. Sending you loads of positive energy. One love. God bless. And all. The best.